Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I am showing some electrical settings, power distribution settings and everything. So in this video I am showing, clearly showing that how some of my subscribers also asked about uh, for the electrical distribution systems. So I am talking about that one. If you like my video, please subscribe my channel. <coughs> So here is you can see some of the distribution system already default they are created. So these systems how we can do it in our uh, do it in our uh, electrical uh, distrib voltage definitions we already created and this one how we can implement it in our distribution systems. Before that you can go to the general settings. So here it is like showing. A circuit description is showing 480 something like that so <clears throat> that's fine and here you can just uh, as per our standard uh, like uh, we are giving uh, r ryb red yellow blue just uh, this is the phase for us so ryb just keep and uh, we need to add some distributions uh, around uh, already we have 230s over here and uh, 208 is here and 400 is there and 480 is here and uh, distribution systems we have uh, uh, 120 208 and uh, 230 400 and 480 227 it's there so if you want to add something uh, we already added this one so if you need to add 400 you just need to add 400 and uh, the voltage value is 400 and just a minimum value 320 and uh, my maximum value is 420 so you just need to add it like this if you have a 480 so just need to add a 480 and uh, uh, 464 our minimum value and 494 our uh, maximum value and even the 230 also here so you can add it that the distribution system that the same way like you can add it that uh, uh, whichever things you need so you can add it that one for example if you need to add a 480 400 over here so you can add 400 slash 230 already we have and then uh, just to give a three phase or three phase then just to give a four number and here you can just give a 400 select 400 and here you can just make a 230 so like that you can add it i'm just simply added added that one and before that we just need to see how how it's work so for example i am putting some lights over here uh, for example, I go go to here and I need to put some lights. <clears throat> I need to find some lights. So this kind of lights I need to place it over here and I'm going to the seating plan and <clears throat> and uh, fixing some lights. For example, vertical place and I'm just to place some lights over here like this. So it's showing like 230, right? The voltage is showing 230 and how we can connect this what Some other light fixes also I can place it some other light fixes same like uh, this one this one and uh, this one and i placing like uh, another kind of lights uh, down lights so place on face so this is also like this so how we can connect it with our uh, dbs i will show you so like this i'm placing and uh, for example i'm just simply placing this one you can arrange it that and some other uh, um, lighting i place it and some other sockets also i need to place it electrical devices and so socket outlets uh, we can say like 450 and uh, we can place it that one and the power we just need to go to electrical equipment uh, some sockets we can place so we can place one sockets over here like uh, we can say this one is uh, height is 450 and create similar and you just need to place some other sockets for this is purpose for our just uh, uh, making um, some power distribution things how it will be fixing and uh, if you go to the 3d view so you can just see how it's look so it was looking like this good it's realistic um changing the scale so you can see uh, all all uh, these are showing perfectly over here i'm just unchecking this uh, view so you can see all the sockets are placed and some cable ties also so we need to fix some uh, so, uh, some uh, equipments so i'm just placing some equipments over here 
so for example some dbs i am placing over here for example i am just placing over here you can fix it in the electrical room but i am just place it over here one two three dbs i place it so we just need to go to lighting first and uh, um, we'll have uh, lighting uh, the power we just given over here this dbs yeah, you can uh, fix it over here so we'll have uh, in the power also just i'm going here and uh, just ch checking electrical equipment is uh, fixes are showed okay that was showing over here before that you just select this one and this is 400 db and this one is uh, we can say like uh, um, for we can just check uh, electrical distribution 400 and 420 we can say it 480 we can one one we can give a 480 uh, simply like this you can do it so select this one and uh, one i am just giving uh, distribution systems here distribution systems i can choose 430 into 400 or 400 I, the both i made it. i using the for 230 into 400 and uh, then the circuit naming i am just giving by face okay and this similar things this one um this one also is the same thing if you want to change that that 480 so you can make it 480 and uh, if you select this one so you will find this for a 480 into this one and giving the some final name db dash lp dash 02 something like you can make it and this one you can give the name db dash lp lp dash 01 like that okay so i'm just deleting one this one and we need to uh, connect with this this much light to our uh, this panel so give go go to power and select this one so select the lp01 and give like this so what will happen this one is the voltage is 230 so it will come like that and even the same thing over here so like you just give a power and just give like this so it will connect it to that db and you can give the circuit number also so it's showing like a, a r1 so if you want to make it a free end so just uh, just give a free end for this one just free end and you can select it this one like this and if you go to the um, uh, edit this one edit the uh, annotation family and just add the uh, circuit and panel also just give a panel and break it this one click ok so just select just stretch a little bit and load the projects click that one overwrite it and so you can see it like this otherwise if you don't want to break it that one you can just uh, uh, unbreak that one just unbreak that one and uh, you can just uh, give some prefix in the prefix so just to give a dash or something like this that if for example we can give a dash click ok and uh, even 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 if you don't know want the space okay you can just uh, make it like this otherwise slash we can give it click ok and load into the project click like this overwrite existing version so it will come like this and giving this one like this you can place the db names r1 y1 so for example for the power also you can give the same process and just to give a whichever uh, the, the db is there so you can give that one for example this power is like uh, uh, it is 230 it's showing so you can just give like a 230 power just select this one go to electrical edits edit circuit and uh, this one they already selected and finish it so if you want a circuit give a circuit just to above the uh, socket you can just fix it and give like this and give a work wire so it will level up like this so you can you can put it like that and even this one you just select the sockets for socket size selecting and just give a power arc wire so that is also created simply you can create it this one like that okay so this is the method we just uh, placing all the um, um, uh, the circuits and everything and you can give the tag for this one like this you can place it and uh, you can place the this one and even for example some uh, some isolators you required go to system and uh, power and you can just check uh, some other isolators if you have um we don't have uh, yeah, some isolators we have three phase isolator single phase isolator so we just need to fix some isolators over here and tab it and uh, create similar so some some you can place it 
and how we can connect the isolator give a power so if you need a 237 then select it and three phase uh, you need so number of pole is three and you can select the the uh, because we we don't have that one okay so it was showing 208 and this one is uh, 480 so we need to assign some some dbs for uh, here okay so just uh, just select this one and i'm deleting this one and i'm just giving power uh 277 okay and uh, this one is the 277 and just to give a power for this one edit circuits and panel name so it is showing over here right so you can give 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 that one this uh, otherwise you can give another, another options like i am just deleting um i am just uh, taking uh, electrical oh sorry uh, devices and giving some uh, electrical uh, these things and you go to the 3d view i think i just need to place at the level of 1200 just go here and you can see all, all the isolator is placed so how we can connect it this one we can just go here and go to power select it and whichever this is 277 okay so just give 277 and uh, the panel name is lp02 this one so just connect it that one and uh, uh, it will connect it like this okay so you can tab it and give the arc wire so the db it will become up over here so you can give the tag tag name here over here like this you can give the tag and this one also you can give the tag and even here also you can give the tag for this one so it is showing like uh, this one 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 why it is showing one if you need to sh give the panel name and the circuit naming like by phase so it will show r1 y1 like that so if you need to give a three phase on this one so just give a power uh, we can give it uh, 277 and just give it three or 400 we can give and three number of all three so what will happen it is going to the three phase db you just connected like this and if you give the uh, <clears throat> circuit number so it will show like <clears throat> R uh, Y B two something like that it is showing okay mm, and here also uh, you can change this one like uh, some other uh, name like uh, some other uh, circuits if, if you need so you can use it that one V two R three and uh, we just need to go to um, panel and uh, default template okay so there is something which one which panel you took took this one this is lb lb21 okay so just uh, select this one so create default one and uh, this one you can move it down move it down so yes so move up so you can see ryb it's shown right so you can go to the power and you can see now ryb the proper uh, uh, the circuit is showing so same guy in this one and you can power it and uh, it's 277 and just give uh, this one and arc wire and uh, you can give the tag for this one so this is single phase so you can give it like that so this is the method normally we are giving this uh, uh, circuiting and uh, power distribution if you can add the power distributions for the uh, dbs uh, do, using electrical settings and you can add whichever power systems you required so first you need to add the voltage definitions over here then you need to add the voltage distribution system otherwise it will not work first you need to add the maximum and the minimum voltage for the or each each <coughs> each voltage and then that need to be reflected over here and that that should be come to the power distribution so this is the method we are showing like uh, uh, power distributions and everything so here already we given the power so just tab it and press it that one and you can give the wire in the pow power also so if you can uh, tag it this one so how, how many power you given you can just uh, tag it that tag it that one and just give a power so automatically it will create so if you like my video please subscribe my channel it is totally related to electrical settings like electrical 
distribution system so if if like you just need to be go to my um, go on my channel watch my all other video and please subscribe my channel thanks for watching thank you and some other cable trade videos already i placed so you can watch my all other videos and uh, subscribe me and support me thanks for watching thank you